Hi, this is Mato. Welcome to my online chess lecture. This is game 2 from the World Chess Championship match 2023. Ding Liren had white pieces and he started with d4. Ian Nepomniachi played knight to f6, c4, e6, knight to f3, d5, and we have the Queen's Gambit. White move. h3. This is a surprise move. How good is this surprise? Let's see. D takes on c4, e3, black to move. Instead of defending the pawn, Nepo played c5, attacking the white center. Bishop takes on c4, a6, Ding Liren castled king's side, knight to c6, knight to c3, b5, bishop to d3, bishop to b7, a4, but now b4. Knight to e4, threatening to win the pawn. How would you defend the pawn? Nepo play this cool move. Knight to a5. White to move. Knight takes on f6, check. If knight takes on c5, bishop takes on c5, and after d takes on c5, knight to d7, and black is okay. Back to our game. Knight takes on f6, check. Black to move. Should black play queen takes knight or pawn takes knight? What would you do? Nepo played pawn takes knight, opening the file for his rook. White to move. e4. Ideally, white would love to open the e file and punish the black king. c4. Bishop to c2. Queen to c7, bishop to d2, rook to g8, rook to c1, black to move, nepo, castled, queen's side, bishop to d3, the pawn is pinned, king to b8, rook to e1, f5, intending to open the long diagonal for his bishop, bishop to c2, black to move, knight to c6, f6 would prevent bishop to g5, the move that was played in the game. We have knight to c6, bishop to g5 attacking the rook. Why did Nepo allow this move? What is the best square for the rook? Are you ready to see the move? Rook takes bishop kaboom, the exchange sacrifice. What a brilliant move. Knight takes rook, knight takes on d4, queen to h5, f6, knight to f3, knight takes on c2, removing the defender of the e4 pawn. Rook takes on c2, bishop takes on e4, and it is now obvious that black has ample compensation for the sacrificed exchange. The game continued. Rook to d2, bishop to d6, king to h1, black to move, c3, what a cool move, b takes on c3, b takes on c3, rook to d4, c2, one, square away from the glory, queen to h6, not just attacking the pawn on f6, but controlling c1 square, maybe. Black played the move and white resigned, and the move is e5. Ding Liren resigned. For the entertainment purpose, I will show you just one line. Let's place the white rook on a safe spot. Then, pawn to c1, queen. Rook takes queen, queen takes rook, check. King to h2. Bishop takes on f3, pawn takes bishop, e4, discover, check, king to g2, rook to g8, check, and what now? If queen blocks the check, then rook takes queen, check, mate. What a brilliant game by Nepo. What do you think of this game? And that is all. 
I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess, then bye for now.